The Royal Australian Air Force's E-7A Wedgetail stands as one of the most advanced airborne early warning and control systems in the world. Based on the Boeing 737-700 commercial airliner, this sophisticated aircraft is outfitted with a cutting-edge Northrop Grumman multi-role electronically scanned array radar, allowing it to detect and track aerial and maritime targets at incredible ranges. This radar, perched atop the fuselage in the form of a distinctive dorsal fin, provides the wedgetail with its iconic silhouette and unmatched surveillance capabilities. Developed under Project Wedgetail, the E-7A was envisioned as a key component of Australia's defence modernisation strategy, aiming to replace the older E-3 Sentry and provide a more agile, versatile, and powerful airborne command and control platform. The aircraft can scan and track hundreds of targets simultaneously, sharing real-time data with Allied Air, Sea, and Ground units. This makes it a vital force multiplier for the Australian Defence Force, enabling coordinated operations across vast distances, especially critical in a region as geopolitically sensitive as the Indo-Pacific. The Wedgetail's radar provides 360-degree coverage, with a range exceeding 370 kilometres for air targets and even further for maritime surveillance. Unlike traditional rotating domes used in older AWACS platforms, the E-7A employs an active electronically scanned array that offers faster updates and a lower probability of intercept. This radar system can track both high-speed fighter jets and low-flying cruise missiles, detecting threats that would otherwise be challenging to identify. Its onboard systems can even identify and classify radar emissions, helping build an electronic order of battle in real time. One of the standout features of the E-7A Wedgetail is its ability to serve as an airborne battle management center. The aircraft carries a crew of mission specialists who operate sophisticated consoles, managing the flow of tactical data and coordinating joint operations. These specialists can direct fighter aircraft to intercept hostile targets, coordinate search and rescue missions, and facilitate air-to-ground strikes. By acting as a flying command post, the wedgetail removes the burden of decision-making from pilots in the cockpit and brings a higher level of strategic oversight to any engagement. The aircraft's communication suite is equally impressive. The E-7A is equipped with secure data links, satellite communications, and ultra-high-frequency radios that allow it to relay information between units that might otherwise be isolated. This robust communications network ensures that all friendly forces are operating from a common tactical picture, reducing the chance of friendly fire and increasing mission success. Whether supporting a fighter sweep, naval operation, or humanitarian mission, the Wedgetail provides the information backbone that modern warfare demands. Australia initially ordered 67A Wedgetails, all of which are operated by NO. 2 Squadron of the Royal Australian Air Force, based at RAAF Base Williamtown in New South Wales. These aircraft have seen operational service both domestically and internationally, with deployments to the Middle East in support of Operation Okra, where they played a crucial role in coalition operations against ISIS. There, the Wedgetail helped orchestrate complex air missions over Iraq and Syria, coordinating assets from multiple countries and ensuring seamless cooperation in a dynamic and often hostile airspace. The platform's versatility also extends to homeland security. The E-7A has been used for border surveillance, disaster response, and major public event protection. Its ability to loiter for extended periods, combined with a long-range radar and powerful communications, makes it invaluable in non-combat roles as well. Whether watching for illegal maritime activity or helping manage the airspace during high-profile events like the G-20 summit, the Wedgetail offers capabilities far beyond traditional military surveillance aircraft. The aircraft's endurance is another key asset. With aerial refueling, the E-7A can stay aloft for over 10 hours, offering persistent coverage over vast areas of interest. In Australia's context, with its enormous landmass and critical maritime approaches, this endurance ensures that no part of the nation's airspace is left unprotected for long. Additionally, the aircraft's 737-based airframe makes it easier to maintain, leveraging existing commercial aviation infrastructure and parts supply chains, which reduces costs and downtime. The E-7A's modular design means it can be continuously upgraded with new hardware and software, allowing it to remain at the forefront of technology. This future-proofing ensures that the platform will continue to meet emerging threats and mission requirements well into the 2030s and beyond. Australia has already committed to upgrading the radar and systems aboard the Wedgetail, ensuring interoperability with US and NATO forces and enhancing its electronic warfare capabilities. Australia's success with the Wedgetail has attracted global attention. The United Kingdom selected the E-7A to replace its aging Sentry fleet, placing an order for several aircraft. 
The United States Air Force, recognizing the platform's capabilities, has also committed to procuring the E-7 to replace its own fleet of E-3 AWACS aircraft. This international validation underscores the performance, reliability, and adaptability of the Wedgetail system, and it places Australia at the center of a growing community of nations using a common airborne command and control platform. The strategic benefits of operating the E-7A go beyond just radar and command capabilities. By investing in such a sophisticated platform, Australia reinforces its role as a regional security leader. The Wedgetail allows the RAAF to contribute meaningfully to coalition operations, build interoperability with key allies, and maintain situational awareness across contested areas. This capability is especially important in the Indo-Pacific, where airspace is becoming increasingly crowded and the risk of conflict requires a strong, informed response. While the aircraft may not carry weapons itself, its impact on the battlefield is profound. It serves as the eyes and ears of a modern air force, providing commanders with the information they need to make timely, informed decisions. Whether operating in peacetime surveillance missions or directing combat aircraft in high-stakes scenarios, the E-7A Wedgetail is a cornerstone of Australia's defence architecture. Its presence in the skies above ensures that threats are seen before they strike, and that every asset in the battle space operates with maximum effectiveness. Looking ahead, the role of the E-7A is likely to grow in complexity and importance. As threats become more asymmetric and adversaries leverage stealth, cyber warfare, and electronic deception, platforms like the Wedgetail will be essential to cutting through the fog of war. Its integration into a broader network of satellites, ground-based sensors, and unmanned systems will make it a hub for multi-domain operations. The RAAF's investment in such a capable and forward-looking platform ensures that Australia will not only defend its borders but also shape the security environment of the Indo-Pacific for decades to come.